it's ferret bath time. I just plopped them in there. And we'll see, whoops, I was about to say we'll see how long I can record them before they start trying to escape. But Kiara has already made the plunge. Now I'm not going to be able to do this one handed with four ferrets, of course, for very long. But this bathroom is getting, it's my downstairs bathroom and it's getting like redone. Oh, of course, because it wouldn't be ferret bathroom without poop in the water. Now I'm going to have to re- Oh man, hold on, let me get that, guys. We're back. Lilo right here doesn't really like bath time, so I don't know how long that's Kiara. I don't know how long I'm going to be able to film. I haven't put the shampoo on them yet because ignore that big rusted stain. That's what I meant, like, when I said this bathroom is getting redone, we need to put new flooring down and everything. And if you hear the um, commotion in the back, it is in the background, it's because my Rottweiler is trying to get into my bathroom because he likes the ferrets, but he doesn't like that the door is separated and he knows we're in here. Festivities are going on, huh, guys? Here's a loft. Oh, there's Lilo. Hi, Lilo. Hi, and here's Rue. He's the youngest and, like, one of the biggest. You can see, obviously, like, this is Rue and this is Lilo. The panda one is... Oh, well, she doesn't want to be on camera right now. My girls, well, girl fairs, girl animals are usually generally a lot smaller than males, but my girls, Kiara, this is Kiara, she has some weight on her, but you can see my boys are big bottomed. <laughs> so, just thought I'd let you see some playtime in the water, and I wanted to show you how I actually bathed them, but we'll do a proper video on that, because... What I'm using right now, though, is Ferret Sheen 2-in-1 Deodorizing Shampoo with Aloe Vera and... Oh, it's not focusing. Oh, man. That's worse. Just my luck. Got the ferrets to behave, and now the camera doesn't want to. With... Tear-free... With Aloe Vera and jo jo Jojoba Oil. Gently cleans and conditions. Deodorizes to eliminate tough ferret odors. Oh, there it is, and you can pause it if you want to read, and then I'll let you do the back. It says, the benefits are it cleans and conditions with aloe vera and jojoba oil, and won't irritate ferret skin. So, there you go. Oh, it's not focusing on the ferrets either. It does seem to focus, oh, hi, Rue. It does seem to focus a lot quicker than my old phone. Hi, Kiara. Hi, baby. Are you getting clean in the water? See if I put my hand in there, they're gonna try to climb try climbing off like up my arm. Because they're a little rotten. They're just little rotten. There's Lilo. Hi Lilo and Kiara. Look at her swim. <laughs> I know that stain on my bathtub does look really bad, but I swear it <laughs> it's stained, like it can't. I don't even know what that's from, <clears throat> but we need like a new faucet and everything. So, there's that. Oh, you can't get out that way, silly. Hi, Kiara. Okay, so now that they've calmed down a bit, they might actually let me show me bathing them. Actually, I don't know because I'm not going to be able to do that with my arm. Hi. Hi. Hi, baby. Is it bath time? Oh, my little fuzz butts. My little fuzz butts. So, so we have them all bathed and now we're letting the soapy water drain. So I can let them, so I can run free, like, you know, clean water and then just make sure I get all the soap off them because with four ferrets, you get loads of bubbles and soap. And, yeah. Look at those clean faces. Look at those clean faces. Look, hi Olaf. Oh, you look so clean. Hi. 
How you want out, don't you? No, we're almost done. We're almost done. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Hi, Rue. You guys, if you, you don't get me out of here. Okay, let's turn on some water. I apologize that it's going to get really loud. I'm trying to let you see. No, 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 Olaf. He's like, bath time again? Rinse off. Rue's like, all right, no problem. Where's my cup? Oh, we gotta rinse the babies off. We gotta rinse the babies off. This is really hard to do one-handed, and I would usually pick them up, which I'm going to do in a second before I get them out to make sure that it's all off. Oh, I missed you, Tiara, you lucky little girl. Hey, I want out, Mom. I want out, Mom. Crazy carrots. Are you going to jump? Oh! Look at Clean Lilo. All right, we'll be back after we run some and dry them. So, they are bathed, and I put them top. This is how I dry my four ferrets is I drain the water in the bathtub after I rinse them and then I lay a couple of towels down so obviously they're not waiting in water or this would do no good and then as you can see Lilo which is her I've already blown dried her on the low setting obviously so that's why she looks a little closer or a little closer to dry I'm going to and then I just do this so they help me a lot obviously they want to be dry too and then I just use a my hair dryer on the low you're not going to be able to hear me because this is loud but I just want to show you it's really hard to do with one hand because I would usually pick one ferret up at a time and then they're not scared of it as you can see Lilo likes it she doesn't like being held down to get blow dry but she likes she likes being blow dry so does a lot Okay, so let me pick these guys up and get this done, and then I will come back to show you what it looks like. Okay, bath time's done. We've been blow dried and all, and are eager, as you can see, to get back to our cage. Oh, and in case anybody was curious, they live in a double critter nation at the moment, or double ferret nation, I can't remember which. They're the same, but different bar spacing. But, um, oh, you escape artist. Get back in the tub. I'm not done yet. Okay, so, um, and then they have, like, I don't even know how many hours of playtime. I don't really, like, time it. It's just if somebody's home and they're able to be out, which I'm home all the time, then they're out. So, that is how that goes.